we're facing big challenges in Buenos Aires because people just don't have a conscience of going to church here. It's not part of their life. People are skeptical about religion. They, uh, they just believe that all the churches are here for the money and we are actually here to give something to people, not, not to get something to people. We want to give them a family, a spiritual family. A lot of people in Buenos Aires uh, are lost and they are seeking for uh, uh, something bigger than themselves. In Buenos Aires, people, people think that to be a Christian is, is old fashioned and God is, is it's for, uh, you forgot about us. It's very difficult to keep your faith uh, openly with another people when the people around you uh, talk about, I don't know, believe in God. They just don't know what church looks like. For them, church is a, is a boring concept. We want to become a church for people who don't go to church. Actually, we want to become a church for people who can't stand church. In 1998, I read The Purpose Driven Church by Pastor Rick for the first time, and I was like, this is the church I want. This will become my own vision. I love this. Now, little did I know that years later, Pastor Rick was going to have the vision, the God-given vision of planning a celibate church in my city. And I'm getting to be the campus pastor. I couldn't be more happy. We want people to know God's love so much and we want them to feel like they can walk through the doors of the church that are wide open for them and know that this lifestyle that we're offering to them and the relationship with God that they can have is totally relevant for them. We really want to target the unchurched community in a mighty way. So we're launching with an outstanding Salback Kids ministry. Our band is beautiful, the environment is great, the place is wonderful. And this would not be possible if it wasn't for the sacrificial support of Salvac Church. There are many good churches in Argentina, very good churches. Um, the difference with Saddleback Buenos Aires is that we're trying to do something for people who feel like church is no longer for them. I believe that the years to come are going to be the best years in my life because I'm, I'm getting to be part of this project. This church will change the mindset of Buenos Aires. <laughs>